What's up, everybody? What be going zone? It is your boy Q, aka Uncle Quan. Welcome back to another part with uh, what game is this? Uh, Walking Dead <laughs> Telltale Series, man. Season one, episode one, man. I appreciate you guys tuning in with me today. I hope y'all having a wonderful day so far, man. Let's go ahead and hop into some gameplay, man. Let's get it. All right, welcome back, guys. Last time we left off, man, we done ran into this little barn, and um, such pretty hair. we got some shelter for the day. So I guess we got to go back here and help um, Duck and Kenny. These camera angles, I got to get used to these camera angles again, man. How you doing, Duck? Good. I'm going to drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. I ain't gonna lie, man. Look, I love kids. I love kids with a passion. But that little motherfucker is annoying, man. I, when I played this game the first time, he was just... Oh, man. He was just annoying, man. Hey, man. What's going on? You need a hand, man? Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. That's a bet. Alright, so it seemed like a pretty... Slow Dad tempo doesn't right know now. How bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid, a boy. Just shot him right in the face. Damn. Damn. <laughs> My exact oh, words. Shit, damn. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. I mean, that kid was already dead, like bro. That. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh... I mean, Sometimes hey. It's kill or be killed. I guess. I don't think I'd sleep good after that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My family. Shit. My I brother mean... and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. I'm gonna have to be faster with these choices, man. I'm used to life is strange. Thanks. Life is strange give you a little bit more time to pick a choice. What's going on, Kenny? Hey there, uh, Kenny. Uh, let's see. Do you need, you need any help? Any help? No, oh, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I mean, shit, I'm okay. I ain't got no kids, though. Nah, nah, no, no kids. Would have liked one, then. You know. So, so what's your, what's your family's plans, plan? Then? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots, and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. I get it. What's your how you son, man? Yeah? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station, and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds, and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. See you. I wouldn't speak too soon. Hee <laughs> hee. Let me shut up. <laughs> Alright, man. Um... So what the hell do I need to do now? I guess I gotta go talk to these two. They're the only ones I ain't talked to yet. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Hey there, girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. Oh, she was in the first grade. So, you're good? Anyway. It's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? I feel that. How did you handle getting through the city? 
Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just... It's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Nah. This things could have all a be reason. providence, you know? Not what we saw. You just never realize when something is happening to you, what you're being given. Maybe this will all work out. Your optimism is refreshing. New. These past couple days, at least. Back in the Hi. Okay, enough Lee. talk, enough talk. Let's go see what this guy got going on, Mr. Herschel. You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I didn't really mean to lie to him, man. I, these choices, like How'd I said, they fast, man. Atlanta? I was on my way out anyway. Timing of all this just happened to be right. Huh. If there ever is a good time for the supposed apocalypse. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to. 100%. Yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? I don't even know, man. My parents are in making. I'm just telling him the same thing right. I told the other dude. Well, I hope they're all right. And now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I mean, yeah. I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? I would say mind your business, but I, I kind of sure. like him. I don't know who you are or what you did, but you. Yeah, I mean, he let me stay in his crib, you know. And fast. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. So whoever you are and whatever you did, keep it to your damn self. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. No! I'll get my gun! Oh here, it's about to go down, y'all. I mean, I'm gonna save the kid first, of course. I mean, it's a kid, bro. Damn, Lee. That's a strong ass punch. Okay, so now, can we go help the other guy now? Oh, yeah, your leg's done for, cuz. Damn, Kennedy's like that. Oh hell! Oh oh oh! Damn! I feel like we could have saved him, man. But if we would have went for him first, they probably would have got on me about not going for the kid. Damn. Bitch, it was a fucking kid, bro. I was worried about the boy. Fuck wrong too, you, man. Hey, let's go, man. That. We ain't gotta stay at this nigga crib Please. no more. Just go. 
I'm sorry, that pissed me off, y'all. I mean, I get that you mad you lost your, your kid, your son, but damn, bro. Trying to save the kid. You got a lesser chance of survival anyway. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. He was probably gonna die anyway. <laughs> well, this is as far as we're going. And it's far enough. Oh, I remember this part. Look. Hey there. You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. No, you might want to be quiet, cause. Fuck! Damn. We're trapped! Ah! No! 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 Run! Hey, is that Gwen? I forgot he was in this game. Is that Gwen? Damn. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? They would have died out I there. I mean, this ain't got nothing to do with and me. We but... let them. Let me just we be can't quiet. trust anybody. We already know that. You'll have to excuse her. The hell he or anyone will. This is about survival. Do you guys not see what's happening? What is it? I mean, shit, we can leave. I, I have to pee. Want to be nowhere where we ain't. I'd want. go out there again in a second. I bet you would. Um, in a minute, Clem. Them kids They've be killing kids, me with Lily. that. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. I mean, this ain't got nothing to do with me. Lee, can you believe this lady? That lady's my daughter. I can see the resemblance. My son won't grow up to be a raging fucking lunatic, that's for certain. Son? Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. bitten, bro. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body. How about you we'll check it first? One hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all somebody the stick this nigga, bro. Up. We gotta throw him out or smash his head in. Kenny, Cause he pissing him. me off. What do we do about this guy? Hit that nigga, cuz. Dad, oh, I'ma hit him. Just a boy. Yeah, kick his ass. Hey, I'll handle this. We kick his ass. Kick his ass, That's bro. Everyone fuck you talking about? Fuck out. Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will fuck yeah, bro, us. Bro, and they will get man. in here. And none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten. That's how you turn. He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. <laughs> upsetting is getting eaten alive. Dad, we get it. It's a big deal. Sit down. Well, that's it. You're gonna whoop me? <laughs> you and what homo parade? This one. <laughs> that's good. Little boy, before you eat your mommy, you can watch your dad get his nose broken. Oh, he threatening. I'm gonna kill him, cat. Stick his ass, Lee. Uh, uh Kenny. Lee. Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. 
Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast. And then, there'll be three. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! The fuck? Knock this guy out. Yeah, hit his ass, bro. Jesus! What fuck you talking about? Oh, man. Oh, hell no, Lee. Stick that... Oh, snap. Oh, Lord! Jesus! Watch out, watch out, watch out. Damn, Lee. Fucking up again. <laughs> Lee just all kind of fucked up, ain't he? Hey, man, get, out my, get out of my clip, man. Come on, get right, get right, get right, get right. Somebody help me, man. There's plenty of y'all niggas in here, man. Damn, thank you. Sheesh. You okay? Shit, I'm straight. You Just straight? Thanks. <laughs> I appreciate that. Uh, guys? Shut up. The military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Shut up. Uh, uh, Damn, man, I had a heart attack. He doing too much though. I told him to calm down. <laughs> I did try to get him to calm down. Panic, right. asshole. It's his heart. Well, really, I was oh, threatening pills. him. <laughs> um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Why do you expect me to help this man after he... What are we looking for? After he was talking all that shit. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I mean, she did save us, so I guess we owe her that. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Let me make sure Clem's straight. If anybody's straight, it's gotta be Clem here. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. I'm gonna look out for the kids first, man. Look out for the kids. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know it's not much, but here, for the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. Already. Alright, um... We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. Just make sure I ain't missing nothing. What's that? Oh, it's another energy bar. Cool. And another one. Here. I wouldn't find it oh shit, I didn't mean to get oh, it to um, her. Thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. Alright, here we go.
Dang, man, I'm having flashbacks. I'm just remembering how Can't. emotional Can't think about this game man. was, man. It was a hell of an emotional roller coaster. I can't believe I haven't played the fourth season yet, man. I started to do it, but then I, I thought about doing a walkthrough on the channel. Everyone out there seem all right to you. Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah, I did. I ain't gonna let nothing happen to you, baby. More? Yeah. Well, I'm not gonna go looking for him. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. I'm gonna uh, keep looking around. Okay. Let's get this out of the way. What's that? This is my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you would have. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. <laughs> Alright, that's the pharmacy. That's when you Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Things have been scary, huh? Yeah. It's not good. I don't know why everyone is crazy. Neither do I, Clementine. Nobody does, I don't think. I bet my dad does. Okay, here we go. Damn, that's kind of sad, bro. I'm pretty sure her parents are done for. Do you she have kids? Know it. No. You don't have a family? Mm. What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like <laughs> yeah. that. I ain't heard that one in a minute. You didn't social answer studies. my question. All right, a little further. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? I mean... I wouldn't blame them. Why? Did you fight? I fight with my mom sometimes. We didn't fight. We just didn't talk for a while. Look, my family's gone and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I got into some trouble and, and I didn't talk to them for a while. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay. Because of the trouble? Let's get this done. I wonder what he did. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. He got bleeding? locked up. A little. I'll find you a bandage. Oh, look at them having like a father daughter moment. I ain't gonna lie, man. I do want a daughter, man. I want, well, I want a whole family, really. I want a son first. But whatever God blesses me with, man, I ain't picky. I'm a family man regardless. Okay. I think we got the band-aid. Yep, we got the band-aid. Let's have a look at that finger. How? It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Albert. 
Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? Um, do I keep it a band with her or do Me? I just... They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, She's okay. probably not ready for that. We man. should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Alright. Oh damn, that was his fam. He should keep it. Oh damn. Find anything? So he's definitely feeling it's a photo of the guilt. family who this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> okay, so that explains what he were, did. Or that you were tied to this place? Hell no. No. I've been sticking to first names for a reason. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Alright, thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. If you guys enjoyed that part, man, y'all go ahead and show your boy some love. Leave a like, man. Subscribe if you ain't already subscribed. And go ahead and click that notification bell so you don't miss the next video. It's gonna be uploading very soon, man. I appreciate you guys tuning in with me, man. I'm having a lot of fun playing this game. This is one of my, like, favorite little chill, relaxed, little story-driven game. And um, I'm happy to be playing this on the channel for you guys. So y'all go ahead and show your boy some love. I'll see you guys on the next part, man. Love you guys. Keep being great. Peace.